Hello there, Paul here, and I want to show you just a couple of features in the June release of Photoshop on the desktop. First one, really important, I absolutely love it. Now in previous versions of Photoshop, if you wanted to cut her out, it's going to be complex. You might start with right up here at the top, select subject. And that's typically where I'll start. Some previous versions, you'll start there. Let's go ahead and show what that mask looks like. We can see this is the starting point, at least, using select subject. So we have to go and use refine edge, all that fun stuff, right? Multiple masks, who knows? Well, in the June release, it's so awesome. Just go right up there to select subject again, and guess what? Photoshop is going to actually recognize this as a person with hair, the hard edges, all that good stuff. All you have to do is click, no hands mode. It does it for you. It happens behind the scenes and look at that mask compared to the previous one. Absolutely love this. It's going to save me so much time because uh, nine times out of 10, I feel like I'm cutting out people and doing some interesting layouts like putting this text behind her head. And what I want to do in this case is uh, jazz up that text a little bit with a fun pattern. And what you'd have to do in previous versions is if you wanted a pattern at an angle, you had to create a new pattern or do some other workaround. Well, in this latest release, it just comes down to selecting the pattern that you want, going into the settings for that pattern right in here, and sure enough, we could change the angle of that pattern. Super easy to do, it makes it look more, a little bit more interesting. And wherever you apply that pattern, you have the ability to change the angle as you can see here. So check it out, give it a try today, and thanks so much for watching.